Let his hands go. That opened up. She moved the guards right there. Boom. Left hook. Sitting them down like a child in timeout. Beautiful work right here by Shakur Stevenson, the phenom. Boxing Gems, G-E-M-S. Boxing Gems. Check it out. Study some of those videos there. The guy's phenomenal. Fight fam, smash that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification. Class in session. Yo should know how to constant frantic lead hand rhythm out the high guard. It's the right idea to control space, but a lack of understanding. Purpose is important when breaking your own guard. He'd also fail to tuck and bring that left shield in tighter when he wasn't using it. The left hook was available for Shakur all night. What? And now Yoshino with a left hand to the body. He can move to his left. Shots, but they're hard enough. They're Guard manipulation is typically just the physical moving of your opponent's guard to set up a punch. Shakur had success using a type of peel on Yoshino's lead hand. When opponents lunge, Shakur has a sharp and accurate check hook, which is a counter hook with a defensive pivot or check step out. Knocked down in his career. In an open stance fencing battle, drawing out the guard is typically setting a rhythm with your lead hand for your opponent to match, then feinting or just breaking the rhythm of the pawing lead hand, leaving your opponent still thinking fence, which draws his lead hand out and away from the target for an easy opening. He found a pattern. Shakur. Straight left. Or lining up behind that jab. He hurt him with that a jab lead right there. hand has been devastating tonight. Shakur consistently used the strategy of getting out the 50-50, aka equal positioning with pivots and step pivots to his opponent's weak side. Sometimes he would initiate offense and use the step pivot for defensive responsibility getting out the 50-50. Sometimes he'd just step safely while checking the wrist, which was his opponent's lead hand. Sometimes he'd use another defensive maneuver and a step pivot to evade offense and sometimes Shakur would step around to initiate offense from an unequal or more advantageous position. But every time, his opponent had to reset to the new positioning and start over, boxing basics and fundamentals that are refreshing to see again at a high level. Simply put, Shakur is at the top of the CompuBox plus minus list for a reason. He's the definition of hit and not get hit. Able to split the guard. See, that's the fight right there that Yoshino needs right there. Getting in the inside, letting the right hand and Shakur meeting him with the straight left hand. Oh, there's a knockdown score! Just the second time that Yoshino has been... Yoshino's corner and he says, the instructions were more. <laughs> Trying to set up, trying to get the lead for dominance, but Shakur Stevenson is too wise for that. He can move both directions. Nice control right there. That's head control. That's what you're seeing right there from Shakur. Number one in the world in plus minus ranking, and he's dominating right now. That lead hand of Shakur Stevenson. A division that, by the way, Bill Haney, the father and trainer. 
constant high guards get destroyed by the young phenom. Shakur probes into power, which means he throws lighter shots away from targets to open up with the heavier shots on the intended target in combination. He powers through the guard, which means he throws all power in combination, which typically disrupts the guard for a hard shot to get through. He pot shots and splits the guard with crosses. He pot shots with looping hooks to get around the gloves to the ears. He'll go high, low, or low, high to get at body openings and open up targets to the other level. If you lean, he splits the guard with uppercuts. He'll pin or frame your high guard, then go to work. Pulls up the right hand. It's in. See, in, in that first two rounds, he's. Miyoshino. Close. He's in punching range. He will take some shots. He will. Woo! And I'm See the combinations right here from Shakur Stevenson. Coming around that guard, beautiful right hook. Chino's leaning forward. And maturation across his back. You see that he'll see an undisputed drive is the real estate you want to be in, folks, right now. That's what I'm talking about. That's what they're about, my goodness. Shakur Haney wildly over Yoshino. And Yoshino's taking a... Eventually, when Shakur feels comfortable in what his opponent has to offer offensively and gets his spacing down, a lunging opponent gets time with sharp and accurate step back counters, which just so happened to cap off the night. Yoshino, even in some of his biggest wins, have taken punishment. That is another shot, and that's a You want to see everything in the arsenal. I think um, I'm going to go out there, box him, beat him up when he want to bang, um, touching his body. I'm beating him up. He's going to leave that ring knowing that I'm the best fighter he ever in the ring with. The last time this dude fought the Southpaw was his pro debut. He's 16 and know he fought all orthodox fighters. It's a whole different world when you get there with a the Southpaw. Especially me. You going to fight the best Southpaw? Like, how do you get in the ring with the best Southpaw after not fighting no South, man? Yeah. Good, good luck, bro. So, so easy work? Is that what you're saying? Easy? Good luck. That's what I'm saying. Good luck.